looking at the red gate. Get her to come over to you. Hi. Oh, she's so cute. Hi. Right, I'll put this nearby, but not too close. To come around the lead now. She's looking. <laughs> she's definitely looking at that. takes her a few days to adjust yeah, to like her new, new space. Yeah. Biggest challenge we're, we're concerned about is having her be in a new space yeah. and there to, to be able to uh, find the litter boxes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. the litter boxes. Yeah. If you're able to start her just in one room, Three that's four, usually the best we're gonna, way. We're going to try that. Okay. Yeah. Hi. Oh my goodness. But we might have to take that one too. <laughs> He's ready. He only four. Ichi, what you doing? Where are you going? She's looking for something. <laughs> Where are you going? Must be alone. No. What's my doing over there? Yeah, when she was calling, I mean, you saw when she was comfortable in the other room. She's like rubbing on everybody and talking to everybody. And we brought her over here and she's just been nervous. So. Make sure she's the, uh, you know what. Yeah. Hi. We have some adult cats who will adjust very quickly to new surroundings. We bring them over, they're like, you know, take a couple seconds to sniff around and. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. your mama. Mm -hmm. That's your mom. Oh, I see you. It's okay. She seems to take a little longer. Mm. It's okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're <laughs> <laughs> It's okay. You're so soft. So you feel how soft she is. Oh, I got a friend. Yeah, you know. <laughs> One thing we um we're used to having food out all the time because mm -hmm. our old cat was the senior wasting kind of yeah um and I know you're really not supposed to do that with them but is she I think she'd be fine um she does eat a lot of wet food I you know if you give her like a measured amount of wet food every day I think she'd be fine with giving her if leaving the dry food out all the time I think she'd be fine okay obviously just. Keep an eye on her weight, you know, over time. Make sure that she isn't overeating, but she has food out all the time here and she's not like, you know, okay. overeating here. It definitely change though when she stops nursing making milk yeah, and stuff. That's true. Yeah. That's very true. Mm -hmm. well, we haven't had a female cat, mm -hmm. so we're. Yeah. We know what to do with the boys, yeah. mm -hmm. with the. Uh, with a mom in the stores, yeah. <laughs> Well, one thing that's that's going to happen, because she has been nursing, she's still producing milk right now. Um, over the, Once she's separated from the kittens, she's still going to be producing milk initially. So it'll take about a week where her teats will actually be engorged and filled with milk. Um, it'll look really uncomfortable. It is uncomfortable for her, but it's not painful. And it usually takes about a week where then the milk will be reabsorbed. Okay. There's nothing you need to do, um, you know, just to be aware when it happens.
happens. Don't be alarmed. <laughs> And the food, it's, you say you can switch right away? Yeah, she yeah. can go right to adult food. And yeah. she's good with, like, I have a lot of the chunk ones with the big chunks of meat. She hasn't had a lot of variety as far as, I think she's just had the pate here. Okay. So you might need to, you know, just check and see, test with different things. Like I said, I don't, you know, she hasn't been picky with food that I've seen. Okay. Hi. Thanks <laughs> And what about any supplements? Like we used to give coffee, pumpkin. So that I would say only if you see that she's having any kind of trouble, trouble going to the bathroom or anything's loose. Otherwise, you know, pumpkin's not normally Sweet. necessary on a regular basis unless okay. they have some kind of GI problem. Now, I'm, wondering okay. if, I'm wondering if she has to go before we go. <laughs> well, there's no way to make her go. So. No, I, know. <laughs> yeah. I know we saw she was just eating a little while ago. Yeah. Yeah. It, it seemed like she was tired of them. That's, <laughs> what, that's what happens. They get, especially at this age, you know, she gets tired of nursing them. It starts to hurt, and the mom cats are ready to move on. Because we were a little worried she was going to have like separation anxiety, but then I was watching today and I'm like, I don't know, she's been having such a thought. She's trying to get away from them. Yep. Yeah, they were attacking yeah. her pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, nature knows what it's doing. Right at the time that the kittens are ready to go, she's, she's ready to be split up too. she does end up sleeping in bed with you guys because you know she hasn't had a chance here yeah. that's what i said we don't really get to know if she's like going to be a lap cat yet or anything so. yeah we have a witch dinner and uh every one of them all of our animals they they gravitate to it and we're kind of kind of like but well, i think it's kind of weird and the next thing you know they're they're like good. yeah, yeah. <laughs> climbing in the wood bag <laughs> Problem for adoption, <laughs> 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 I believe I have one too. 
<laughs> Kittens out, they are out. <laughs> she's like, so tiny compared to me. Yeah, she's only a little over eight, eight pounds, I think. What's normal for this? Like, what is that's, I mean, for her, it's kind of stature and everything. She's definitely a good weight. I wouldn't say she's underweight. No, yeah, she doesn't really look. Oh. She might put on some, you know, like you said, after she stops nursing and she gets to like hold on to those calories yeah, rather great. than it all going to milk. So, yeah, that would be fine. But And the churro, we've never used them for the cats. Is that I, I know they yes. all love them. She oh. has some in her suitcase that you'll okay. get downstairs that you'll take with you. Um, she does like it. It's a good, it's a good thing, especially in the beginning when you're trying to get her used to an environment. It can be a good sort of icebreaker to get her a little bit comfortable or if she seems a little nervous about it, they can get her, you know, to calm down a little bit with a treat, so. I don't know, the way they skip something. Yeah, she's, yeah, she's just hanging out. out. She's closing her eyes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, you like your parents, huh? Yeah, I think when she... She's like, take me away from these babies. <laughs> That's what I was noticing today. I'm like, I really think she's had enough of These crazy kids. <laughs> we have a setup where she'll be able to look out the slider and the repeater. Oh, see nice. birds and Fantastic. squirrels and oh, nice. chipmunks. And... We, have a, we bought a dog bed because we had planned on getting a dog like a few years back. Uh -huh. So it's a big, huge bed we never got to use. Oh, so wow. Like, oh, love that. Yeah. yeah. That sounds like a cat's dream. I might, might be sleeping in one side. Right, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, set, Brian. I'm not purring yet. <laughs> I'm waiting to see if she purrs. Yeah. She definitely will for you. Maybe not yet, but she definitely will. She has a real loud purr, actually. Oh, nice. so I cute. love her. Yeah. <laughs> I I think it's gonna get her anything she wants in life. <laughs> uh, That's one thing we we can never talk. Uh, oh, yeah. it, it's like almost like he didn't know how to meow. Huh. He's meow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Next door, that I would brush her with, and she would just love. love. I would do it all down her back, and she would be like <laughs> rubbing on me, rubbing on the brush. <laughs> yeah. She's cute. Mm. Mm. That's exactly right. <laughs> yeah. So that was terror. Did that was spoken for? They all are. Oh yeah. boy. And that's what oh, we could decide if we wanted a baby or not. And then so as soon as I saw her, I was like, oh, yeah. I know. It's a shame too, because no one ever wants the older ones. And they're so. And she's still so young. Yeah. Such a cutie pie. You want to try it too, Mom? <laughs> well, let's open this first. Oh boy. <laughs> we may have to uh, bring these back to you. <laughs> I know.
first in here. So okay. she is watching my party. Yeah. How did you want to do? Okay, I guess I'm going to be the bad guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> okay, so. Can we go home nice. and give him the treats and things? <laughs> it's all good. It was nice to meet you. And now, unfortunately, I'm going to be the bad guy. Yeah, you and I guess she's going to have a feast tonight, so she'll be happy. Come on, let's close her out. Come on, let's see. Smoother than I thought. Oh, yeah, yeah, it did. Mm. She wasn't even squirming in your arms or anything. Oh, that's great. I think I can pick her up with one hand compared to the other. <laughs> 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 he was so long, she would hold him and he would scream. You know, you know be touching the floor. <laughs>